welcome! Okay, today we're going to be looking at both Captain Marvel's DC Shazam and Marvel Studios Captain Marvel, Carol Danvers. So both of these movies are good. It's kind of crazy these both came out so close together, but um, just how things go. So we're going to look at both of these figures. Of course we got uh, the Captain Marvel here. This is an amazing figure, I think. Uh, it's got kind of a nice metallic look to it, a little translucent. Uh, looks just like from the movie. And here we got Shazam! So, uh, doesn't quite look like the actor, Zach Levi, but uh, it's a pretty good figure. I put a Shazam sticker on the base of the stand. That came off of the Aquaman uh, Blue Ray. Just a sticker that was on it, so I just put it on the stand. But yeah, it doesn't look like the actor, and uh... Whoosh. Oh, I'd like to purchase some of your finest beer. The red is uh, kind of a plain plastic look. The cape looks pretty good. They printed that uh, gold detail around the edges. And here's behind the cape. So Overall, it's a good figure. But uh, this one, I think, is really nice. Can't really say anything bad about it. Um... I kind of like this mohawk head better, so that's what I keep on there. I put some Tamashi flame effects to uh, give her that fire punch look that she has throughout the movie. So that works out pretty good. They're a little wobbly, but uh, looks pretty accurate to what she did in the movie. Whoa! So I like both of the movies. Uh, Captain Marvel, I think, was good. I don't know uh, what people expected from it, but like, I got what I expected. And then Shazam is a great movie for kids, teenagers, uh, whole family. It's a lot like Big. And these are the stands I used. They are Kaiser brand 20 SMB on the left. Um, the one on the right is a smaller scale. It just is known as the 5.5 inch uh, figure stand. Those five and a half inch stands are good for female characters because they are smaller stands. 